but uh, it has been shown that metacognition reduces substantially during dreams that uh, during our dreams we are experiencing but we are not telling ourselves oh i am experiencing this because if we did we would immediately ask questions about continuity like how did i arrive here what am i doing here where i'm going next and then you would have a lucid dream which is what lucid dreams are lucid dreams are dreams in which you are metacognizant and regular in regular dreams you are not and then you might say well but i report my dreams so I had to be metacognizant. No, no, no. You are metacognizant when you remember your dreams. And then by mirroring them, by reflecting them on the mirror of reflection, or, or in the mirror of metaconsciousness, after you are awake, by appealing to memory, only then do you know that you had those experiences. But during the dream, you are like a leaf in a tsunami. You are just going along with the experience. You are experiencing, but you are not metacognizant of the experience. Yeah, so this this as you mentioned is related to the the ephemeral nature of dreams in terms of our ability to remember them. I think everyone has this experience where you wake up, you remember it vividly, but then within seconds or a split second, it falls through your fingers like sand and you can no longer remember it. And basically this probably has something to do with the fact that you weren't meta aware um, in that state. And so somehow this must be related to the ability to encode that in memory. Yes. I 